Morning guys, it's SimpliA here with another review video. Again, this is going to be two e-liquids that I'm going to be reviewing today. And also, I hope you all had a, a good Father's Day yesterday. And I'm going to happily say it's the first day of summer. Now look, what can you see? All I can see is rain. Welcome to Britain, that's the first day of summer. Also, it's also the longest day of the year today and that is due to the leap year that we just had and um, yeah let's get all the crap out of the way let's get into the e-liquid reviewing um, I'm going to be reviewing two liquids from Suicide Bunny and it's from the the Cloud Company range um, I do have the, the entire collection here all samples not for resale they all came in 15 mil bottles and today I'm going to be re reviewing uh, Revel, which is this one here, and that is the berries, cream, citrus, and cereal flavor, which I currently have on my tsunami. And this is one that I've been using in the last 24 hours. And this is Sky, and it is a lemon cookie and cream flavor. So yeah, we're going to be reviewing these two t uh, this morning. It's currently five past nine. The video, I'm hoping the video will be ready by three o'clock. And that's only that's just due to the, the fact that YouTube is quite slow at uploading videos. But when you consider the amount of videos that are being uploaded to YouTube every day, that's not bad. Anyway, um, I have put on the Canthol uh, 26 gauge and you're looking at 11 wraps which is a uh, dual build and I'm using the Cotton Bacon version 2 by Wick and Bape it smells lovely I've already tried it I've already tried it and I can tell you now the berries, cream, citrus and cereal it's a really good combination of flavours um, I think that there's too many flavours in this particular in, that, in, in the Revel liquid I think there's one too many flavours um, we're just going to have a look at the principles of this e-liquid. You can buy it in 15 or 30 mil bottles. The 15 mil bottles starting at £8.99 and for the 30 mil bottles you're looking at £16.99 with the nicotine levels at 0, 3, 6 and 9 milligrams. 90% uh, VG uh, so it's pretty much max VG the PG element's not really a factor in, in this liquid, or the other one, the, the ratios are the same in the other one, and I think it's the same ratio across the entire Cloud Company uh, e-liquid range. Um, yet to be desired for taste, but it's really good at cloud production, I must admit. Um, the flavour notes are berries, cream, citrus and cereal. The flavour note groups is cream, fruit and sweet. Um, let me just have a quick look. There's me, doing my single airflow when I should be doing a dual airflow. It's definitely fruity. There's a strong, mild, fruity element there. I guess the cream, there is a cream element, that's like the last that's like the last portion that you'll taste after you exhale. You'll 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 feel that, that creamy exhale um, just after the the fruitiness. The sweetness goes in. You exhale with the fruitiness, and the cream just kind of cleanses your palate a little bit. Um, it's not overpowering. It's not sicky. It's it's a really good vape. Um, I'm gonna vape on this for the rest of the day after I've tried the uh, after I've reviewed the Sky one. Then I'm just gonna go back to using the Rebel one. Um, and then I'm going to be using another one, and then I'm going to be doing another video tomorrow. Um, so yeah, keep an eye out on that one. <coughs> Again, all updates will be on my Twitter page. All updates will be on the Twitter page um, in regards to that. Um, let's have a look. Yeah, so there's a milky cereal, uh, kind of have a milky cereal taste to go along with it. I guess that would be the cream and the sweetness. I guess that would be a bit more of the cereal element to it. Um, I wouldn't wouldn't subcategorize cereal in this flavour. That's the flavour that I think that should not be in the liquid. It's um, 
you know, there's, there's four elements, you know, the berries, cream, citrus, and the cereal. The citrus works really well, which is the sweetness. Uh, the berries and the cream, don't know where you got berries from. I would guess berries is like the equivalent to the special K for the cereal element. Um, it's out of nine reviews, it has three out of five stars. I think that's a good star rating for it. I think if, I think if Suicide Bunny, I think if you got rid of that cereal element, then I think it would be a really good vape. If you just increase that fruitiness, make it a bit sharper, a bit bitter, I reckon that would really justify it. I mean, that would be really good. I wouldn't mind trying that if you guys were to tweak it a little bit. Um, yeah, it's made in the USA as always, uh, along with their entire range. So I'm going to quick wait. Also, I forgot to mention, on, on, it's on 35 watts on the VT60, uh, just over 5 volts. And the resistance is 0 0.75 ohms. It's got a good kick. It's got a good citrus kick at the back. Yeah, because when you inhale, you get the sweet. You get a little bit of that sharp citrusy uh, taste. It's really good. Um, yeah, it's a really good vape. I recommend this vape for anyone who likes fruit and likes uh, a little bit of sharpness to their to their e-liquids, like a spiced apple kind of flavour. Um, it kind of replicates a bit of that that, that kind of element. It represents uh, the spiced apple flavour. Um, although there's no spiced apple element in this e-liquid, it would easily replicate it if they were to put it in there. So maybe replace the cereal with the spiced apple, and you never know. You never know. It might end up working very well. Um, it's not it's not hugely popular. I I think it's great. I'm gonna continue vaping on it until it's bone dry. Um, but yeah, that's the the Rebel by Suicide Bunny. Not a bad vape. Not a bad vape. I do like the uh, the labelling. The labelling's really cool. Nice deep purple in there. Do like it. I'm a bit of a Bit of a snob when it comes to labelling on um, on the liquid bottles. If I see like a low resolution print on a bottle, I'm going to consider it of poor quality. Um, but that's my personal preference. Right now, we're going to try Sky. And the Sky. I need to refer to my tablet for this. The Sky uh, is exactly the same as Revel. It comes in zero, three, six, and nine milligrams of nicotine. The pricing is the same, eight ninety nine for the fifteen mil bottle, sixteen uh, ninety nine for the thirty mil bottle. Um, it's a lot more popular in regards to reviews. It's got a four and a half star review based on that. That's based on thirty one reviews plus my own. Uh, the flavour notes is lemon cookie and cream. I don't know where the cookie element comes from. It's very strong with the lemon, uh, the lemonade. Sorry, um, I would consider it more of a lemonade and cream flavour. Um, the flavour note groups is creamy, fruity, and sweet. Spot on. Got it all. And of course, again, made in the USA. Um, let's quickly drip on this. There is a little bit of the Revel still on there. But uh, we'll burn some of that off as we go. So you never know. You never know. Mixing these, mix, mix these two together might take, make it taste even better. Right, we'll give it a quick go. Just going to dab the top. I'm not going to soak it through. Dab the top, just so I can get a, a fair opinion rather than uh, drenching it when I want to use the other one. So yeah, this is the the sky. I've done it again. I've done a single wave flow. It's supposed to be dual. I'm such an idiot. Oh, that's kick ass. It's a really good flavour, really. The lemon is so prominent in this e liquid, it's so strong. Um, the cookie, well, I've never had a lemon cookie before. I'd, I'd, I'd put it in a, I'd, I'd say it's more lemonade cream than uh, a lemon cookie. I don't know where the lemon cookie really comes from. Um, but yeah, it's, um, it's described as being a bit savoury. It's not savoury. Um, I mean, it's each to their own. I mean, it depends on what device you're using. It depends on if, if, whether you're sub or you're using an RDA. Or, or it doesn't matter. 
whether you're using the taste element will be different. If you're using something similar to the VT60 and the Tsunami 24, then you can have an overall perspective of what I'm describing. If not, then if you've got something better than that, then the taste experience will be a hell of a lot more better for you. If you have something that's, uh, let's just say, a downgrade of what I've got, say more intermediate, um, so like uh, the Sub Mega 2. If you've got the Sub Mega 2, that would, that's a justified taste for it. But if you've got the VT16 using a Tsunami or above, you're going to get a good flavoursome uh, experience from it. Again, it chucks clouds really well. They all chuck clouds really well, hence the 90% uh, VG. Um, would I vape it all day? Yes, I would. I've been vaping it for the last 24 hours straight. Um, again, you'd be surprised at how little I've actually had to use to vape it for the last 24 hours. Um, it's only a small RDA anyway, uh, even though it's a 24 mil deck. Um, but yeah, the lemon notes are really strong, vivid. Um, from the moment you inhale and exhale, it's all there, it's all tingling around your mouth, and, and it's really nice. If you like lemons and you like lemonade or that sort of thing, it's really refreshing. Like if you have like a like a heavy meal, you're going to want something refreshing to drink after it. This is the, this is the kind of e-liquid that you're going to want to use. Um, personally, yes, I'm going to use it. I recommend it. I recommend it to everyone who enjoys Suicide Bunny and ends their range. Um, overall... I'd probably put this at a near, probably my fifth favourite from the Suicide Bunny at the moment. I've still got their entire collection to go through, um, which is why I'm doing two at a time. Um, <coughs> I might I might bash out like three tomorrow, I might bash out three the next day, we'll see what happens. I just need to get these guys over and done with, and then I can get on to the next one. Um, but yeah, we'll see what happens. Um, let's have a little look. Yeah, it's 100% vegetable, uh, vegetable glycerin. It says 100%, but in the description it says 90% VG, so I'm not sure if there's a little typing error there. Um, but regardless, it's a really good, it's a balanced e-liquid. They're both really balanced e-liquids. They're, they're not intense or strong. Uh, they're not huge throat hitters. They are good all-day vapes. Um, and if you're on a budget for 15 mils for £8.99, that will last you a good me that one bottle will last me about a week depending on how strong or how often I'm vaping on them um, but yeah that's been the reviews on Sky and Revel by Suicide Bunny I hope you guys enjoyed that also for all future updates follow me on Twitter description of the um, description of my Twitter account will be below in the description along with um, Capital Vapes, who um, thank you very much, who supplied me for the purpose of reviewing these. Um, be sure to hit those guys up, Chapel Road and Worthing. Uh, probably the best, uh, if not the best, um, shop in the south, southwest, uh, West Sussex area. I'm always going to be going there, always. Got such good stuff. Big variety of stuff. Be sure to go down there. And... Yeah, there's not a lot much to say. Um, yeah, if you guys go to my Twitter, that's all the updates that you're going to find on a more regular basis. Um, if not, hit me up on Facebook, which is a simply a. Again, that'll be in the description below. Um, also, if you like the video, thumbs up, subscribe. You'll get the videos on a near daily basis. If not, it'll be every every day after or so. Um, but there's always going to be a definite video on a Tuesday. It was more regular on a Tuesday, but since I've got more e-liquids to review, it's going to be more regular. Um, and that, of course, those updates in regards to those um, reviews will be again on my Twitter. So follow me on Twitter. It's the only way that you're going to find the most recent update for everything that I'm doing. And uh, also, I've got a couple of things going on with a couple of other uh, companies at the minute. Um, they're sending me a package out today, and I'm going to be, be reviewing their um, their beloved device, which I'm going to be uh, unboxing. And they're also going to send me a range of their e-liquids to review as well, which I'm also going to be using with the device that I receive. So there will be um, one unboxing video, along with one e-liquid review at the same time. And after that, there will be separate uh, e-liquid review videos um, as as we go on 
Um, so I'm going to try and crack these out as quick as I can um, because I don't want to be, I don't want to surplus them out behind me. I want to try and get ahead of myself. Otherwise, I'm just going to be working right place trying to get these videos done. Also, I need to quickly jump on to Facebook myself. I need to do a shout out for someone. It's really annoying. Facebook, come on, Facebook. I was recently added to the Sussex Fake Club. I'm very excited. It's a very good club to be in. Um, also, for everyone who is a keen vape enthusiast, you're going to um, remember this name and you're going to recognise this name that I'm going to shout out. And it's Kevin Jeffrey, aka the Worthing Vapor. Um, personally, I'm a big fan of him. I've always been a fan of him since I got into vaping. Uh, as soon as I started vaping, I started looking at review videos. He was the first one that popped up. Um, I jumped on him like a bandwagon, um, and I've been watching his videos ever since. Um, there are many other vapors reviewing out there at the moment, um, but when it comes to local knowledge and close to home, you know he's the best man for the job. So, uh, Kevin, thanks for adding me to the vape club. Um, like I said, I'm hoping to see you and meet up with you soon, be it tomorrow, Tuesday, or Wednesday. Can't wait to get to know you on a bit more of a personal basis. Um, I love your videos. Continue doing those videos because I love your videos and I love what you do. Um, I'm going to end the video. And the reason why I'm going to end the video is because, one, I have work tonight, which means I need to sleep during the day. And because it's raining, it will help me sleep for a bit longer. And also, I need to prep for the package that I'm going to be receiving from a particular e-liquid company which I will be reviewing and revealing on the day that I receive it and also there is a competition I do have a competition going up I just need to find the one that I'm looking for there we go um, I, wasn't, I wasn't more clear in my last video and in this video it's going to be very simple um, I'm giving away the original bunny by Suicide Bunny it is a sample, so it's not for resale. I'm giving it away uh, for the competition. And um, the competition is very simple. And it's going to last until... Bear with me. It's going to start today, on the 20th of June. And I'm going to allow this competition to roll on until... I'm going to allow it to roll on until the 24th of June. So you have Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday and uh, Thursday to enter the competition to win this bottle and on the Friday I will be picking a winner um, the winner will be selected at random there is none of this uh, I'll get my friends to do I'm going to get my friends to enter into the competition so I don't lose out on this I'm genuinely giving this away for free f because you guys are amazing and since I've started this um, this YouTube channel I've, I've grown with a lot of people and I've got to know um, some more experienced and uh, more professional uh, vaping enthusiasts, you know, like Kevin, getting to know him is going to be fantastic. It's the same with the Capital Vape Shop in Worthing. The guys there are amazing. Um, you know, I couldn't, I, I couldn't be where I am without these people. And the reason why is because our community is full of support. We help each other out where needed, and we don't take, turn our backs on each other. We're always there to help each other out. It doesn't matter what walk of life you come from. The main thing is you vape, and if you vape, you're in a very happy and well-respected community. And I love that, because I thought I wasn't going to get anywhere with this, and here you go. I'm slowly but surely getting to a point where I'm happy, and um, I'm always excited about the next big thing that happens in our community and in general in the industry. So yeah, uh, the competition rules are, uh, all you need to do is go onto my Twitter, you need to tag my name, A simply A, and all you need to do is just say, I want the bunny. That's it. That's all you need to do. Take my name and then just write down beside that, I want the bunny. I will select someone at random on Friday night and the winner will be revealed on the following morning. So it'll be Saturday morning, the winner will be revealed. I will send you a personal message along with a um, all the details that I'm going to need from you to send this to you and um, I'm going to publicly announce the winner before that so I hope you guys are really excited about this I'm excited about giving this away, it's my first giveaway video I can't wait to do more um, so yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video
Kevin, I'll see you very soon, aka The Worthing Vapor. I'm also going to put his channel in the description below so you guys can see him because he's bloody awesome. Can't wait for the next video. I'll see you guys then.